This is the Argon 18 Gallium Pro that belongs to the Colombian Miguel Angel Lopez of the Astana Pro cycling team. Lopez is now in his fifth year with the team from Kazakhstan and he has shown continued great promise with his results, including overall victories in the Volta Ciclista a Catalunya and the Tour de Suisse, two stage wins at La Vuelta, including the young rider classification and third overall placing at the Giro d'Italia, as well as being a two-time winner of the young rider classification there. With all of this out of the way, let's move on to the bike. Superman Lopez, which happens to be his nickname, stands at 1 meter 70 tall which is 5 foot 7 inches in height. Now he's opted for a size extra small frame which tips the scales at just under 800 grams and allows the use of up to 28 millimeter tires. The frame of course is painted up in the Astana colour scheme and has a few war wounds too along the way. Uh, this one by the way is his spare bike as denoted by the 2 sticker on the rear of the seat tube. The Astana squad use wheels from French brand Corma and are the only squad in the World Tour to use these components. Lopez has a pair of the 32 WS Plus wheels and they have a really nice carbon hub shell where the straight pull spokes are held in place from. The depth of them is 32 millimeters and the tires on these tubular rims come from a small German brand Wolfpack and they are 25 millimeters in width. The cassette fitted to the rear wheel is an 11 to 32. So the mechanics here have done a bit of work to get it to work with the Shimano Dura Ace 9150 Di2 rear derailleur. And that is of course linked up to Shimano 9150 Dura Ace Di2 levers and front derailleur too. The stopping power on those Corima wheels is provided by a pair of Shimano Dura Ace 9000 calipers. So those are a previous generation from Shimano, but certainly still up to the job. Chainset is an FSA power box with carbon cranks. It has an integrated power meter too, which comes as part of a collaboration with German power meter specialists, Power to Max. The crank length is 170 millimeters, and an interesting combination on the chain rings is that of 5336. Pedals are Look Kio Blade carbon pedals, where they release tension of 16 newton meters. Steering comes courtesy of team sponsor FSA, and Lopez uses some SLK compact bars in a width of 40 centimeters. They're held in place via an FSA OS99 stem, which is alloy, but then wrapped with some carbon. It's 100 millimeters in length and has the Shimano Di2 junction box held in place with the rubber strap. There's a GPS mount from American brand K-Edge. And finally, the bar tape is a traditional cork style from Prologo. Seating, that also comes from Prologo with the dimension saddle complete with neck carbon rails. It does also have a little cutout in the middle there too and it's fitted on top of an FSA K4 seat post with extra FSA decals on it for maximum sponsor exposure. Finishing touches include the name sticker on the top tube, the number and its mount that fits onto the rear brake caliper mounting bolt, some grip tape to help keep the transponder in place for any races that use them, and last but not least, a pair of Tax carbon fiber bottle cages. They keep those bottles nice and securely in position. Now I do hope you've enjoyed this look at the bike of Miguel Angel Lopez. Let me know what you think of it down there in the comments section below. And also remember to like and share this video with your friends too. And don't forget to check out the GCN shop at shop.globalcyclingnetwork.com. And for two more great videos, how about clicking on the links on screen right now?